Yo! Well, let me get a camera a chance to focus, focus, focus. Cool. So look, man, it's been about three to four weeks and I haven't posted a video and it's, it's overdue. So back videos every Tuesday, but first I wanted to let y'all know I finally have a mailbox. So people hit me up on Instagram, Twitter, and say they have clothing lines or whatever, and they want to send me stuff. So now you can. Address is right here. Damn. Address is right there. It'll be in the description of this video and every video from here on out. Um, not asking for anything at all, but you know, if there's anything that you want to send, uh, now you can. All right, so look, real quick, getting my day started, headed to the Serato office. Uh, it's a couple new features on Serato and I'm not too familiar. So they're about to show me what's up real quick. Yeah, and a scratch session too. And what exactly are you about to show me right quick? Oh, what's up? Um, yeah. I'm gonna show you about the 1.9.3 update and how to use Link. So you can have two Serato uh, computers linked over a network, so no cables. And you can sync them up together and you can be like looping shit together and stay in time. It's pretty dope. Get right into it. So I guess first thing I'm gonna, I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get these all hooked up to my computer. Straightforward. Set a loop on this guy. Now, I'm gonna press Link on here. And that is now ready to link to this computer. So you need to update your software. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm outdated. <laughs> One point nine point three. Gotta update real quick. Pretty straightforward. So I can just throw in like whatever, whatever track now will be able to sync to what you're playing. So let's say I'm gonna stop this. Uh, Sample, but let's say I just load up this this track. Press sync or link. Okay, so now none of the decks are playing. And then all three loops are playing down there. Kind of crazy. You can see these numbers down here. These refer to the like the absolute position on the record. So where you get it to like absolute zero right there is the beginning of the control tone like the zero point of the control tone. So you can see I've conveniently marked the sticker at a 12 o'clock position there so it lines up. Now that's cool because that means that technically if there was a cue point here every time it would start exactly there because that's an absolute mode. But I'm not, I never DJ in that mode, I use relative. But I kind of want both if I can so that every time I load up the track I know that the 12 o'clock position is going to be right there. So what we did is we incorporated that option as a thing called sticker lock and that option is now enabled and I've just got it on spin nearest so that means that if I didn't have a track loaded here or here and I loaded it up and then you can see it's loaded directly to the first cue point that's because mm -hmm. you've got that preference set in your menu right I'm pretty sure if we go here yep play from first cue point now that's mm -hmm. you need that enabled to, to make it work that means that when I drop the needle on the record you'll see it'll jump back and it'll wait until this 12 o'clock position of the sticker reaches 12 o'clock. And if I do that with another song, I load up another song again. They're all the same song, apparently. <laughs> um, again, it'll wait till I get to that 12 o'clock position before it starts. That means every time I load a song, no matter what, if I have my sticker here, it's going to load off there and it's going to wait until the sticker on the record gets around to 12 o'clock before the first cue point hits. Which means I can 
like know that every time I load up a track, 12 o'clock position is going to air, and I'm not going to have to press a cue point. That's tight. Which is really, really helpful. So, yeah, any song. One time for the Serato fam, Matt, appreciate you, AKA Cut Corners. Um, yeah, stop by the Serato offices, they show me a bunch of stuff. And I think that's a wrap for today's vlog. Make sure you hit the subscribe button below, comment, give me a thumbs up. Yeah, till next week. <laughs>